Autograph baseball going on. Dynasty. Somebody's going to win some spots right now. Three spots are on the line. Good luck in the race action. Lucky number seven, a little shuffle there, and let's go. Okay, Kyle, you're out front. Kyle looking to close this thing out. Here comes Daniel. Daniel D. Oh, but wait, Kyle's got it, man. There are some spots for you. So you got the red jersey. You moved right into first place. Or you actually stay in first place a lot of the race. So that's kind of surprising because usually no one holds first place for too long in these races, it seems like. But those are your three spots. You got them, man. Congratulations. So I'm adding your name to the list right here and let's go ahead and start the randoming and see who gets which letters each list will go through seven times I'm gonna start with the owner names stack the list up side by side right here All right, lucky number seven. There is the first random. So just a heads up, if we do pull the Joe DiMaggio autograph signed ball uh, that's multi-signed, that'll go to random between everybody in the break because there's a whole bunch of signatures on there. We're just going to, that's a grand prize hit and it will go to random uh, if we pull that particular baseball. Multi-signed DiMaggio. We've had some, we've had Babe Ruth come out in a baseball box ring. We've had some epic pulls. So I just want to say that. Here we go, seven times. Wouldn't it be great? Lucky number seven. Here we go. There it is. So there's all kinds of big treasure pieces that can come out in this thing. And it could be an Aaron Judge. I'm going to uh, put this in alphabetical order. No, Dan, you, you were in the race. You were in the race to win spots. I'm going to put this in alphabetical order by the letter and so we'll see Frank G's name come up so I don't think you had a full in it I can double check real fast though let me see here's everybody's letters So I'm going to tell Daniel with 100% certainty right now. Make sure I didn't make any error. Oh, 
Okay, yeah, that's that's right. So we had that race going on. You definitely were in that thing to win it. Uh, we'll have more of these autographed baseballs becoming available after the break and all that stuff around here. So let's see what we can get. this thing I think there's another seal there's another seal it's a sticker right there that's right open sesame let's get some treasure here we go open sesame I always thought it was open sesame like one word but it's actually open says me <laughs> that's stupid I think I heard it as a kid and I was just like open sesame meant like treasure open treasure but you know we open so much treasure I'm like an opening treasure pro so it's open says me and it was like a, came from a movie or something like that I don't know but anyway we do have treasure we are opening it what is it gonna be mm-hmm let's see if we can identify the autograph is it a Joe DiMaggio multi sign ball? It is not. It is something really cool. Sparky Lyle. Oh, look at that. There's no question. I mean, that's got to be Sparky Lyle. Yeah, 77 American League Cy Young winner. Oh, we have a confirmation right here that, that is Sparky Lyle. There's no question, though, that it is. But what a cool one to get. Maybe there's a big treasure ticket, extra ticket or something. I don't see one anywhere. Sparky Lyle, two-time World Series champ. Some nice accolades there. All right. So this comes out for Joe. Joe Carter, congratulations, Joe C. Boom. A little bit of baseball history coming out here what's cool about these two is there's also a number on some of these so you can see the little number of you know it looks like it's uh it's four of 36 i believe kind of hard to see yeah four of 36 right there as a numbered limited edition ball out of here all right So Joe got a Sparky Lyle, and I'm going to link up the next one of these. Congratulations to Joe. Okay, so what what is happening next? Well, let's take a look around here, and I'll link a few of 